I'm Brad Gilmer. I'm the executive director of the Advanced Media Workflow Association, the AMWA. And as Richard mentioned, the AMWA is exploring how we can make uh, the FIMS project um, very open and uh, uh, easily uh, understood and, and I think a conventional open source way while still achieving the objectives of FIMS, which really is to become uh, a building block that be, can be incorporated into manufacturers' products and spread interoperability. Also, I think an interesting thing to consider here is that the AMWA is actually publishing its specification through the use of a, what's typically been used as a software versioning control, uh, GitHub, as, as Richard was talking about. So when you talk about something where you would like to encourage the adoption of what you're doing in other uh, projects and other work from other people, IPR is a consideration. It's a practical business consideration these days. It's just the way things are. And the objectives of the AMWA IPR policy are to end up with contributions that come in where it's clear what the nature of any IPR is that's associated with those contributions, where the contributor grants us, the EBU and the AMWA, the right to include that contribution and publish it under our copyright. I think those things are fairly clear and, uh, and conventional. We, uh, not long ago, revised our IPR policy to try and make it very much a mainstream, um, easily understood, open source type oriented policy. And again, we adopted the uh, Apache 2 license, which is a well-known license within the open source community. So as we work toward this using GitHub as essentially a distribution methodology for our specifications, we're looking at how we can adopt the AMWA IPR policy to um, provide the appropriate notices within, within that platform um, and to be sure that we have the rights from a contributor to go ahead and publish those things under an AMWA and EBU copyright. So as Richard said earlier, the reason this is being put forward as a proposal and it's not a done thing yet is we're just trying to uh, dot the I's and cross the T's on exactly how we need to present that, what modifications we might need to make to our IPR policy in order to support this going forward. But generally speaking, we're very excited about making FIMS a much more open, much more visible project where people can see the work that's going on under the hood. Um, and we really look forward to building a community where people um, who aren't necessarily uh, participants can see what's going on, pull from the project, and really make use of all of the benefits that GitHub generally has built. And uh, I think the project is looking forward to becoming part of the larger Git community. Thank you very much. Um, as we say, this is a proposal, so watch this space. And if you have any feedback, we've got an email address up here. If you can't read it, it's fims-dev at list.ebu.ch. We'd love to hear your comments. Um, and uh, also, if you want to contact uh, Richard Cartwright uh, at SAM, you're welcome to do that. Richard.cartwright at s-a-m.com. Thank you very much.